It's me, Mario! Hmm. Ah! Oh. Yahoo! <laughs> Yahoo! Battle! That's really weird. Anyways, hey there guys, Luigi Vance Twin here. Welcome back to another episode. Let's redo Pokemon Emerald on the last episode. Team Aqua, Mount Pyre. Uh, uh, if it isn't obvious at this point, judging by the sidebar, Tattle of all. And that's really much everything, I guess. Yeah, everyone hates losing, so that that's a common theme. And on this episode, we're gonna continue exploring Mount Pyre for a little longer. I don't know, I think we're getting closer to top. All I know is we're getting to single battles now, which is a good thing. Because, you know, double battles are kind of a... Uh, God damn it, Hariyama. I'm kind of annoying, like that Hariyama. Mud shot your face! Too bad I don't have Mud Bomb. That crap could lower accuracy better. Almost like mud, mud slap. Except, and like I said, it lowers accuracy. And it hits more. It, it does better damage. Either that or it lowers speed. Either way, mud bomb's an okay move. Oh no! Not my soft sand! Now how will my ground type moves get more power? Not like it matters though, because I still have surf. In fact, I don't even know why I'm using ground type moves in the first place against a fighting type. Their defenses must be good. Not their special defense. Normally their special defenses are crap. Hey, one more level until swamps can evolve. I think. It's either 35 or 36. I think it's 36. Yeah, it's 36. Actually, I have a rare candy. I could technically do this just to get it out of the way. Do I still have a rare candy? Yes. Ah, fuck it, we're using the candy. Hey, look, someone's evolving, hooray! Not by force, either! Hey, congratulations! Your slump has evolved into a slumpert. Hooray. Too bad she didn't learn any mo new moves. But now she's better. Look at her. She's gonna wreck some faces at one point. Alright, uh... Lions, guess what? You're going back in the lead. Sorry, Swamps. I know you just evolved and you want to show off your newfound power. Maybe one day. Maybe when I fight against Team Aqua. Ooh, another double battle. At least, they're in sync. Which is weird. They're in sync. Weird. Alright, let's see. What you gonna send out? You're both kind of psychics. One of you is actually a psychic. Say, oh great. Sableye and Wobble Fit. Wobble Fay. It's a buffet. Alright, um... This could actually be bad. This could... Escalate either very quickly or very horribly. Don't counter lines. Ow! The faint attack! Which is apparently renamed to faint in later generations. It's still weird. No, oh, don't headbutt Sableye. Sableye's a ghost type. God damn it, attack! I will destroy you! Okay, safeguard. That, that's fine, I guess. It's questionable. Okay, good, you didn't use attack again. Thank God. That move's annoying. Come on. Don't counter. You're using Destiny Bond. I can't do crap with it. Uh, tail whip, and then you use fly, because I can't uh, freaking attack you. Can't a freaking attack you. That's that's a sentence right there. Ha! 
the one time you decide to use tag uh counter. That's funny. I almost said tackle, but then I realized that's dumb. Well, if I can't know tackle, it's short. Does why not know it? No, why not? It's the same as Wobbuffet, I think. It only knows counter and mirror coat. I think once it evolves too. God damn it, no! Don't ah, oh, you put yourself in my poking nav. I didn't want you to. No one wants that. All right, I see an item up there. It's probably. I think we're at the top. We are at the top. Anyway, doing all that gets the TM30 Shadow Ball. I'll probably teach it to someone. It's a ghost type move. And for some reason, ghost types are physical in this generation, so that's perfect for any, I don't know, normal type people. Might teach it right now, actually. Who can know it? Lions and Thoron. Huh. I could teach it to Lions. I could get rid of Tail Whip. Lions doesn't need it. And I could use some ghost type coverage, too. Or psychic type coverage. I mean, I, I got, like, Tattle here. We're gonna like dark type moves for some reason. Uh, how's Thoron's attack? Better than a special attack. Ah, but now that I think about it, Thoron will be useless against psychic types. I'm gonna teach it to Lines. Lines, you can learn it. Yeah, we'll replace uh, something with Shadow Ball. Uh, let's replace Fury Swipes actually. I need something to replace those two. Gotta use Fury Slaps. Now no Shadow Ball. Congrats. Alright. Let's get out of here. Let's by going down the hole. And picking up this item right here. The Lax Incense and my bag is full again. I miss I miss later generations where everything's freaking like Um words. What am I trying to say? I don't even know anymore. Alright, let's give Tattle the black glasses so she can have her dark type moves boosted a little bit. I got no one for charcoal. I need to sell like half of these items. Either sell them or use them. Like seriously, I still have potions. <laughs> I still have potions. Who still has potions? For rails. Alright, we'll just do this. Get rid of the potions. This is like menu fun time with me. And it's super potion you because you're the last one. And then everything else is fine. Experience share, yeah. Mystic water, I might re replace self same with that. All right, we got the Lax and Sense. That, I believe, boosts up water type moves. Either that or something else. Nope, and it's a item that slightly lowers the foe's accuracy. Fun fact! Give that to a Wobble fan and you get a why not. Well, if you breed it with the with if you breed a water buffet while holding that item, you can get a why not is what I'm trying to say. Um, because that's like the only way you can get a why not. Don't ask me why, but it is. All right, now where do I want to go? Either up or down. Let's go up. I might regret that. I totally have. Damn it! If you went down, you would have gotten the uh, sea incense, which boosts up water type moves. Uh, that is also the only way you can get uh, a Zuril if you want one. If you give it to a Meryl or a Zumeril and have them hold that while breeding them, you can get uh, an Azuril. I'm not. I, I'm not going back for it. That should have went down. I don't know why it went up. Down's the obvious choice. Ugh, whatever. Whatever. What's done is done, and I can finally get out of here. I would say move on with my adventure. But that is also a lie, because we still got Team Aqua to deal with. And I'm sick and tired of our always running into Pokemon now. That's stupid and that's annoying. Alright, I just want to let that sink in because I love this freaking uh, theme. You know, the vampire exterior theme? That's awesome. 
Anyways, Team 48, skill swap. Let's you swap your abilities with your opponent. Imagine giving that to a Pokemon that can actually know it, and you have a slacking. That slacking will be unstoppable. Oh god damn it, Cory, I don't care! I don't care about your swimmer, friend. I don't care that you try to hit all- Why are you telling me this? First love, I'm a girl! I will slap you too, if you stare at another swimmer. That makes no sense at all. Oh look, Max Potion. That's like the best healing item out there. I think there's a hidden item over here. I say think like I know, but I don't. Hi, Vulpix. I would have count you if I really wanted you. I should have went for you, but it's like I should have picked Vulpix, but then I'll be repeating myself from Leaf Green. Because I had a Vulpix there, and her name was Disco. And she was awesome. Ultra Ball here. I wasn't paying attention to what item I got over there. I got distracted by memories of Disco. Disco was the best Pokemon. Right next to Jules. And Jules clutched to win for me. Alright, we're gonna leave Ace in. Not Ace, Lines. Ha! <laughs> Too bad for you. If you came earlier, you wouldn't you had to battle Wimpy Team Magma. But since you arrived now, you have to take on us toughies. Are you really that tough, or are you just saying that to boost your own ego? Because, uh, to be fair, you're a grunt. You also have a Carvana. I would say I would be, like, I would say that's, like, threatening, but it's not. Uh, we'll headbutt you. I would, I would use Shadow Ball, but it's a dark type. Dark types are resistant to ghost types. Don't ask why, it's just logic. Uh, I should have let you take on Team Magma first. Yes, you should. Now, if you excuse me, there's more exploring I gotta do. Item? Item? There's an item here. This just screams hidden item. Doesn't it? It totally does, does it? No? No hidden items? Uh, pointless quarter is pointless. I could use my item finder. That is a fact. Uh, I don't even think I have it equipped. Nope. It's buried around here somewhere. Is it in one of these? Yeah, it's only. I was right! Hidden items. But it's a zinc. I could boost up my uh, Pokemon's EVs even more. Excuse me, I gotta go around you. Is there anything else here? Hidden item? Hidden item. Wild Pokemon. Hidden item? No hidden items. Alright, fine. Alright, we're gonna ignore you and fight you. I see a double battle. No! Those Team Magma Goons got here ahead of us. We can't fall behind. Oh, if only we didn't go to the Weather Institute and block people's paths. In fact, I don't even know why I'm here, actually. They're not even in my way or blocking my path. In no way, shape, or form. Unless I would have gone straight to Lily Cove. Then I would find out they were blocking my path for some reason. I thought you were one of the magmas who happened to come back. Well, I am dressed in sort of their colors. Except for the obvious green. Hmm. I'll leave these two up. I am confident in my Pokemon's abilities. You! We saw your mouth chimney. You don't belong to either team, so why would you be here? Maybe because you're potentially blocking my path. That could be it! Oh, I know, you tried to join Team Magma, but they wouldn't have you. I don't think we'll let you join our team, Aqua. I, I have no interest in either. In either. Oh, you have a Whalmer. That thing is an HP hog. Okay, let's see. We're gonna do Shadow Ball, potentially lower its special defense, which again is weird because it, Ghost Type is not a special move. Special type. It's a physical type. It's weird. But it's perfect for combos, I guess. Boop, boop. Lower that special defense. No, you're using rollouts. You remind me of that mill tank. 
Alright, uh, headbutt you, wing attack you, and see where we go. Yeah, Wilmer's gone, that's a good thing. And Lions grew a level, yay! Aw, oh, Ace, that was your time, that was your perfect time to, like, level up! Okay, we got Zubit. Bye, Carvana, no one likes you. Oh! -ho! A burn, I guess. Is that even a burn? I don't even know. Uh, no, don't attack lines. Attack the Zubit. It's funny how you can select your uh, teammates for attacks. It makes sense because if you have a specific strategy, go for them. Oh, Ace, you finally grew a level. That was weird. If you're gonna miss with anyone, let it be Team Magma. Jeez. If you want to join Team Aqua that badly, we can consider it. I said no. I have like zero interest. Do you have? Is there anything? There's stuff. Be, there's stuff behind you guys, but I can't do anything. Team Magma's Maxi. Oh wait, no, it's not him. Team Magma's Maxi got ahead of us, but we also got what we wanted. The Red Ore Preserve at Mount Pyre. I, Archie, now have it in my possession. Foo foo foo. Now we can bring our ultimate objective to fruition. Okay, team, we're pulling out. Oh no, this cannot happen. Not only the blue orb, but the red orb has been taken. The blue and red orb must never be separated. They belong together. What are those men trying to do with the two orbs? Oh yes, was well, it Team Magma who came and took the blue orb first? Well, in their haste, they left us behind. I couldn't imagine what exactly it could be. But I would like you to have it. Perhaps it'd be useful in some way. Why would I want it? That's weird. You're weird. What do you gotta say, old man? Mount Pyre is where we calm the spirits of Pokemon that have passed on. It is a high place where one can see all of Hoenn. The disembodied spirits of Pokemon must find solace here. Is it coincidence that you're here? Where are you here on my tale? A tale long told in the Hoenn region. I guess. It happened long, long ago. The world was wrecked by a ferocious clash between the Pokemon of the land and the Pokemon of the sea. The Pokemon of the land raised mountains, created continents. The Pokemon of the sea raised huge waves and carved out oceans. Their fierce duel raged without end. The world was engulfed in a massive inferno and vicious storms. The blue and red orb brought in the end to the calamity. Life poured from the two orbs and become the enraged adversaries. A pair made docile, dove deep into the sea, where they eventually disappeared. And that's a cool story, but I feel like there's something missing. Hmm, I don't know. Could be just me. All right, what's over here? Hidden item. Hidden item. That's not a hidden item. Hidden item? No hidden item. Pointless. Yes, if you want to catch Pokemon here, I'm assuming no. All right, there's nothing else here. There's nothing else to do here. Let's just leave. I could have just flown out there, but yeah, yeah, there is nowhere to go. All right, so. Wonder what we could do now. God, come on! All right, so I lost my train of thought. Actually, oh my god! I decided to say screw talking about Empire. There's a lot of goddamn Pokemon. In fact, bring my Super Repel. Super Repel, I need you. God. Anyways, I'm gonna call this an episode. Um, but before I end off the episode, I kind of want to make- God damn it, Amy, I don't care! Before I end off the episode, I kind of just want to, you know, make it to Lily Cove and avoid these trainers. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Thank you. I don't want to deal with cool trainers just yet. I want to make it to Lily Cove City. Mainly because uh, it's kind. I kind of recommend you do this before you do anything else. I kind of recommend you because let's just say we're gonna have to come back here eventually, and you don't want to go all the way back to Fortree City. I also kind of need the heals. And I don't want to do Safari Zone, but we're not gonna explore Lily Cove City today. Not today. In case you haven't noticed, Team Aqua's here, like right here. And, uh, um, I need to go all the way over there, actually. And, uh, ignore Brandon, first off. First and foremost, we're gonna ignore Brandon. He's here. I don't know why. But, uh, 
if you notice, our pass blocked. I mean, all of you guys are way more training. So we can't go anywhere, but like I said, we're gonna ignore everything in Lily Cove City. I just wanna come here so I can get the fly location so I can just come here later because we're gonna head off to, back to Mount Pyre actually, because there is a route that I kind of ignored and you kind of recognize the theme over there. Where's my map? Did I not get a map? Wow. Oh wait, it's my Pokemon map. Duh. God, I got like old Pokemon. We're gonna go to Route 123. That's where we're going. You know, you know that route I said we're gonna come back to later? Yeah, we're gonna come back and explore it. So, if you like what you see here, then slap that like button. Really like what you see here, then slap the subscribe button. You won't regret it. And if you do, blame yourself for listening to me. I might battle these trainers off screen. And I'll see you guys then. I timed that horribly.